hi guys welcome back to my channel today's video is gonna be on this look and i don't know i just feel like doing a fresh summer look um very glowy because we are um we are so close to summer already that i'm just like feeling it i really want it to be summer i'm very excited for summer um i hate i love the cold weather but i'm always cold like <laughs> i know it sounds stupid but I'm like a very cold person like I get cold easily so I'm very excited for summer I'm excited for the outfits I'm excited for the beach for the music festivals for concerts I don't know I just have so much planned already that I'm very very excited um I hope you guys like this video and I did change my hair I did um some blonde in it I just kind of lined it and I really like it um I was very scared to go back to blonde um, it did get damaged a little bit, but you know, just I'm just gonna take good care of it. Um, my hair's growing out as well, so I'm very excited about that. Um, a lot of changes are going on, and I really hope you guys like them. I don't know how long I'm gonna keep it because I do miss my black hair, but you know, summer's around the corner. New look, gotta go lighter for summer, and yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Um, so yeah, let's just jump into the tutorial. So the first step that I'm going to go ahead and do is moisturize my skin. And I'm going to use this one because I really like it. It's very thick and it's very concentrated. So I'm going to use this one because, like I said, we are going to be in the sun for a while. Don't forget your neck. Um... Then after that, I'm going to go ahead and use a sunscreen, and this is from the brand Kula. And this one is SPF 30, and it smells like cucumber, which is really a plus for me because I hate the smell of cucumber. I mean, the smell of sunscreen. So I'm going to go ahead and use this, okay? Then after that, I'm going to let all of that absorb in my face, and then I'm going to go ahead and... Um, prime my eyelids. So today, I just, I don't know. I'm like really feeling like the gold. It's so weird because the sun is not even out today. <laughs> At least not yet because it's pretty early in the morning. I usually film like around 9 in the morning. That's when like there's no one in my house. And then there's no noise going on. So yeah, but hopefully it gets sunnier later on. But I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyelids with... This um, eyeshadow primer from Thank Me Later. It's called Thank Me Later by Elizabeth Mott. And I believe I got this in a boxy charm. The only thing I don't like is that it doesn't really have a color. So it like doesn't really cancel any like redness or darkness on my eyelids. I kind of want to do like golds because I don't know. I feel like I'm always doing golds and for some reason. But um, I'm going to go ahead and use... This one by Revlon. It's the Photo Ready Eye Art. It's like a nice um, coppery color, like gold copper color. And I'm going to put this in my eyelid. Take a shadow brush and just kind of blend that in. This is a synthetic brush. I feel like since that shadow is kind of like wet. It'll blend it out a little bit better. And um, you guys, these eyeshadows are really good. Like, I already tried use them like three times. And the glitter side that this has is bomb. Like, super good. Like, by far one of the best um, glitters in the drugstore that you could find. And they stay in place forever. Like, um... They stay in the eyelid for a long, long time. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm going to go ahead and take this. Um, I don't know if they still have it, honestly, because I bought it like such a while ago. It's this Pixie Shades of Daylight um, little trio. It looks like this. And I'm going to go ahead and use this color right here. It's very similar to the eyeshadow that I just put on and 
I'm gonna go ahead and take this Mikasa E300 and I actually just received this brushes from them I bought it myself but I do have a coupon code with them I am affiliated it's not sponsor or anything but if you guys want to purchase some of this eyeshadows you know it'll save you some money if you guys use my coupon code I'm gonna go in my chocolate um chocolate bar and I'm gonna take this color right here I hate how they don't have the colors but it's like a very um light brown color and I'm just gonna put this in the crease you Um, this is another brush from Mikasa and this is the E230 and I'm just going to take a little bit of a darker brown which is this one right here and I'm just going to really concentrate it on the outer end of my eye just to give it a little bit more dimension you know and then just a little bit like not a lot and then I'm going to take the same blending brush and then just kind of blend it in And then for my brow bone, I actually want to do a shimmery shade. I'm going to go ahead and take the same synthetic brush that I used earlier and then the same um, Pixie Quad. And I'm going to take this light color right here. I'm going to mix them. And then I'm just going to put this on my brow bone. Blend everything out. And that's pretty much it for the eyes. I like don't really want to go too crazy. For primer, I'm going to use my Smashbox Photo Ready. So to get like that glowy fresh look, I'm going to use NARS foundation. And this is in the All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. And I'm in the shade Medium 2 Santa Fe. And I really like this foundation even though I'm oily. One of my favorite ones. I have said it on my channel before, I think. So you just need like two pumps like not that much and you just and it's very lightweight like i'm not even kidding and it's pretty like good coverage so i'm just gonna dab this on my face you guys see how much product i get from like one two pumps and what i like about this it's like you could build it up so let's just blend this in And I'm going to jump into concealer and I'm going to use my um, Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. And uh, I'm almost done with this. Can't believe it. And I'm just going to do the little triangle. You guys know. Just to cancel out any darkness. And I'm going to do the bridge of my nose. Just very good at appear smaller. Two lines right there my chin and my forehead and I'm just gonna blend that out I'm using the airspun translucent powder um, be very careful when you bite this one because there's one that does have color so just keep that in mind um, so I'm just using this one and don't take out the little thing that comes in it because then it's such a mess I regret taking it out didn't think it would make such a mess so I'm just baking and in this um, darker concealer. I actually don't even remember where I bought this, but it's like a really cheap one. I want to say it's like a dupe for the LA Girl one. And I'm just going to contour my nose a little bit. Just a little bit. I never really got the hang of contouring your nose. But I feel like I'm getting it down and I'm obsessed. Because, yeah. Then for the rest of my face, um, I'm using the airspun as well. For bronzer, I'm gonna go ahead and use my Mac Sun. I'm obsessed with this bronzer. 
it's perfect for summer you just want to have a light hand on it because it could be a little bit too orange if you go a little crate crate on it so i'm just gonna like do my forehead bring some color back to my skin i love this bronzer it does have some uh like shine glitter to it whatever you want to call it but i love it and then after that i'm gonna dust off this um powder up in here then with the same air spun i'm gonna go and clean because i did not contour so I'm going to clean down here a little bit. So that's just really going to clean and make your face slimmer. <laughs> so then I'm going to go back to my eyes. I feel like I'm all over the place, but I'm going to go back and finish my eyes. And I'm going to go ahead and take this Mikasa E3 310 brush. And I'm just going to um, smoke out my lash line. And I'm going to go ahead and use the chocolate bar, that um, light brown and dark brown that I put in the crease. I'm done with the eyes. I'm going to prep them for falsies. You don't have to wear falsies. You could just go with your mascara. But I love me some falsies. So for mascara, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. This is by far one of my favorite drugstore mascaras. I feel like L'Oreal kills it with mascaras. And then I'm going to hit my bottom lashes as well. So, um, my camera died. And I just dusted off the, the powder. And I apply falsies. I do, I do have a video on how I apply my falsies. So I'll link that down below for you guys. Now I'm going to go back into chocolate bar. And I'm just going to highlight the inner corner of my eyes. And I'm going to go ahead and use this color right here. So it's like a gold, gold shimmery shadow. I'm just really going to pack that there. Because we want to look fresh and glowy. After that, I'm going to go ahead and highlight. For highlight today, I'm going to use my MAC Soft and Gentle. I feel like this is such an amazing highlighter. Um... And I'm just going to highlight my nose, my cupid's bow, and my cheekbones. Do you guys see what a nice glow it gives? And I kind of like going like after I put it on, like up and down just to blend it a little bit. Because I don't like it when there's just like a harsh line. Um... And I'm going to put some on my forehead right here, like above my eyebrows. And now we look all glowy, girl. Um, look at that highlight, though. Okay, so for lips, I'm like very not sure. I just want it to be a bright color because summer is all about those bright colors. So I think I'm going to use my NARS Catherine, and it's like a nice orangey color like a salmon color so i'm just gonna apply this real quick so this is the final look and i really like it i wasn't really planning what to do today so yeah i really like the final look um the eyes are very simple and glowy the skin is very glowy and dewy the lips is just pop of color perfect for summer I really hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Um, and let me know if you guys want to see more videos where I'm like talking through what I'm doing instead of like voiceovers. Because I think like those are could be a little bit boring sometimes. But 
But yeah, just let me know what you guys think. Sub and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you guys on my next video.